to, okay, let me, let me get serious. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl. Get on there. Okay, so the lighting is horrible right there. Let me put you, put you, mm, yeah, the lighting is so you like right there it's not a little better it's I'm so tired um it's the Thursday night I don't know it's probably around 8 30 9 o'clock or so um we just yeah we just put Gianna down in bed like 30 minutes ago so it's probably around 8 30 at night um, tomorrow is Friday. Yeah, at night I'm doing, I'm doing my like night routine, you know, before bed, brush my teeth. I'm gonna put my skincare on. Um, I am currently using, just started using this past week. We're gonna see how it goes because my skin has been in this funky funky breaking out weird transition I don't even know what the hell I'm going through and they're like um like these small bumps like especially on this cheek and on my forehead it's so weird but I have been using a new foundation for the past month I'll show you and a new concealer so I don't know if it's that, like if it's too heavy for my skin. I've been um, using for the past month because one of my friends recommended this is the Too Face Born This Way foundation. And I got the one that's matte finish since I have oily skin. It's 24 hour um, full coverage wear. So I don't know if this is too heavy for me because ever since I started using this, I've been getting like bumps and they are I already have like rosacea but it's like a lot worse so I don't know if it's in my head or if it's this and then I also for concealer got the NARS um radiant creamy concealer if you're curious I'm the color custard in the concealer and in the born this way matte foundation I am light beige but not only did I get new makeup, I also started this past week a new facial moisturizer. So, and I'm very familiar with this brand, Shawl. I actually met the founder. Um, this brand is also known for making people break out. But I was breaking out before I tried this. So, I don't know. Oh, I think. Now is the time, like, all right, the weather. Okay, first of all, hi, if you're new here, I'm Vanessa. I love making like vlog videos. I'm a mama, wife, dog mommy. Um, and I was at home for like five months during the whole COVID quarantine stuff. And now I'm not making posting as much, I should say, because I'm back at work at a new job and I've only been working for a month now so I'm just adjusting to my new schedule but I'm starting to settle in I'm starting to get like a little routine going so I feel like I'm gonna get back on my YouTube game at least posting a video once a week so that's that what was I gonna say I don't even know at night before bed, I have my little essential oil pouch here. I love to zibble and zabble on different essential oils, but my two favorite oils are um, from doTERRA. And one is called Breathe. And these are roller, um, roller ball ones, like so they roll on. And one is called Peppermint. It really doesn't matter which one I grab but whichever I end up grabbing, I love to take a little 
and like press against um my nose and literally guys it like opens you up and like I just love going to bed with like this sensation of like being able to breathe I feel it just makes me feel good and then um if I have headaches which I kind of have a little bit going on right now I take a little peppermint and I put it on my um, temples and it feels so good there too so I like to do that at night um, while I'm getting my life together also guys um, a little update personal update I am known to flat iron my hair because I have, as you can see, just wild, thick, wavy hair. So I am known to always have my hair straightened and stuff like that. But um, I guess due to stress, <laughs> you gotta love stress. This past year, I've been noticing, especially when I'm overly stressed, that I start to shed a lot of hair and, like, just lose a lot of hair. So I'm trying to control my stress with, like, decompressing and a lot of meditation because I'm not the type to, like, go on medication or do anything like that. It's not to that. But I um, want to get my hair health back on track and, like, my scalp health back on track. So, I got this product. I got four bottles of it. And so far, I think I've been using this for three weeks now, I want to say. Um, it's Vegamore Grow Advanced Hair Serum. It's to restore, retain, and renew your hair. It has hemp in it, CBD. And um, you're supposed to rub this on, on your scalp. And they... They have really good reviews. They claim to give it at least 90 days, three months. Um, I got four bottles, so I've been trying that out. It's been like two or three weeks I've been on it. I want to say three weeks. Um, so once I finish with a couple bottles, I'm going to be doing a hair review on this. I also decided that I'm going to try as long as I can to not straighten my hair. I know I did it like last year. I didn't straighten my hair for like six or seven months because of the heat damage and how much like that just destroys your hair. So even though I'm like not into like the whole like this going on, I mean, I look crazy right now because it's nighttime, but um, I'm going to really try to get my scalp and my hair health back on track because my hair is just not like it used to be. It's crazy what how how your body changes just like due to your circumstances you know like climate changes and just personal changes it's just so weird so I've been um trying Vegamore and I just finished my first month's bottle of um sugar bear hair vitamins and I have two more months to go so I'm gonna be doing like this whole I'm looking forward to it like this whole hair journey growth video um within the next like month or two because i really want to try the products out first and give my full like honest review because i spent my hard working money on this um this bottle vegamore the first one i bought was like was it 68 dollars i believe when this bottle was 68 dollars and then I got it. And then like the first week of having it, I was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I want to get more because I really want to try the whole three month experience. So I went back online for Labor Day sale. They had 20 or 25% off and I got the three month kit. I want to say that was like 120. I'm not sure. But that's a lot of money to be spending. And then the Sugar Bear Hair Vitamins, I got the three month supply. I want to say it was like 80 or 90 dollars so i'm really trying to like you know get on a healthier track when it comes to my hair my mind as well but anyways so between the sugar bear hair vitamins and the vegamore grow hair serum in a couple months i'm gonna um let you know how i feel about that do you get what i'm saying okay good 
my daughter. Maybe I'm being too loud. Um, yeah, so I have work in the morning. So it's just hard, you know, I, it's just hard to vlog during the week. So I really have to like plan out now videos that I want to do because now that I'm working full time, I want to at least post one video a week. So I'm going to start writing down my thoughts and my ideas for videos. Um, like this weekend, I am hoping um, that I can go to Trader Joe's and look at their fall foods, like their fall stuff. I love going to Trader Joe's for like seasonal things because they come out with the cutest stuff, like cookies, foods, snacks, breads. Um, I, I just love Trader Joe's. So I'm hoping on Saturday that I will be able to stop at Trader Joe's and I would definitely like make a video on what I get if I were, if I go. Um, so that could be something coming up this weekend. And then um, I have some fun plans coming up with the family to go like pumpkin picking, apple picking. I definitely want to vlog for that. I'll take you guys with me. So I do have like some fun like fall, fallish stuff coming up that I want to upload. And um, I'm so tired. Can't even get my mind right. I'm excited that I'm going to be getting my car back tomorrow. My car has been in the shop for like, as you guys know, who've been following me for like five or six weeks now because it was stolen and had so much damage to it that the repairs just took like six weeks to get done. So I'm excited to get my car tomorrow. What else can I update you guys on? What else can I update you on? Um, as far as the, I wanted to make a video also on that foundation, the Too Faced foundation, but I showed it to you guys. It's fine. If I will buy that foundation again, I'm not saying it's not good. I think it's good, but I'm the type that likes light coverage. Um, and that foundation is definitely full coverage for sure. It doesn't feel heavy feeling wise but when I look at my skin it looks a little heavy but that could just be me only because I like really super serum like serum texture like foundations when that's more like a little thick so that's my thoughts so far on that foundation but I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Guys, forgive me for my like spaced out ass brain and like how MIA I've been. I swear, like, like, I keep saying like, I'm just trying to get my life together. Okay, y'all, I'm a mama. So I'm balancing work life, mom life, preschool life, excuse me, with Gianna and, um, I feel like time is just flying and I can't catch up and I feel like I'm gonna just wake up and it's gonna be Christmas. I even started thinking of Christmas shopping slowly. That way I'm not like running around like a mad woman like I do every year for the most part. But anyways, yeah, I just wanted to make a video, let you know that I am here guys and I am okay and i'm trucking along i'm a tired mama but i'm a grateful and thankful one did that rhyme did that sound like i was about to bust a rap <laughs> i gotta go to bed i have to go to bed i have to go to bed follow me on instagram at vanessa pampa 91 please leave a little thumbs up to let you let your girl know that you stopped by to check up on me and um there will be a video up this weekend sunday or monday sunday or monday y'all